Hello, sweet souls. Happy Saturday, February 25th. This will be your full length reading on TikTok and YouTube if I exceed the 10 minutes, which I'm sure I will. Follow me on YouTube. Um, there is, I'm, I am doing the giveaway. Uh, Tasha's Divine Guide at Sweatshirts. Um, sweatshirt, and I'll give it away at the end of February. You have to be a subscriber on YouTube. All my other announcements, I will add the links um, and the captions to the page. You can also find any other information in my bio or description of TikTok or YouTube. Okay, I'm gonna call in St. Michael. St. Michael, please return to sender. Anyone sending ill will, do thought, word, or action toward myself or the viewer. I'm gonna call in the Holy Spirit, Angel, Saints, Spirit, Guides, and Ancestors, and ask for a message for our greater good. So I pulled from the wisdom of the oracle, and we got another great reading. So the first card of God is happy, happy. Happiness is returning into your life. Happiness. And then we have go the distance. The changes you're making are going to be long-term. They're going to go to the distance. Milk and honey. You're being led to an abundant life. Happiness, prosperity, joy. Um, the universe is giving you a leg up, assistance at this time. The bottom of the deck is by the book. You're living according to universal law. With the understanding what you put out, you get back. Underneath that is building, bo building blocks, building a stable foundation. Uh, Alexa, pause. So I clarified... Alexa, pause. I clarified happy, happy. And what I got with the angels and um, ancestors oracle was drum. And it says dream and journey. You're on a new journey. And they want you to dream big. Because you are limitless on what it is you can create and manifest for your life. So go the distance. I clarified go the distance. And I got high priestess, harness mystic power. They're saying... So for many of you, you're awakening to spiritual gifts and they want you to embrace it because um, there's a purpose. It's gonna help you go the distance, long-term results. So they really want you to tap into these spiritual gifts because they are blessing from God and it's gonna help you have success um, in the long run, okay? So milk and honey. Milk and honey um, clarified by unleash the wild within. This is you. Stepping into that true authentic power that you have being your true authentic self and going for your dreams and your wishes and your desires Manifesting all that you desire and tapping in to that power within you. Okay, a leg up This is the universe stepping in to help. I got wait for important information Oracle you're receiving Information from the divine guidance from the divine to help you to make changes that bring in happiness that will go the distance to bring in success um, okay, so then at the bottom of the deck is by the book, which is living according to universal law, understanding that what you put out, you get back, that the universe will match the vibration and experiences that match your vibration, whether you're in high or low vibration. Be graceful in movement and action is at the bottom of this deck. So to me, it's like you're not defending who you are. You're not out trying to convince anyone to believe you are who you are. You're just um, taking inspired action that the divine gives you, and you're not necessarily sharing it either. You're keeping it to yourself. So that's awesome. All right, let's see what else we need to know. Okay, what do we need to know? Holy Spirit, Holy Angel Saints, Spirit Guides, and Ancestors. What do we need to know for our greater good? Sword of truth, truth, clarity, and victory. You're headed toward victory. Perfect clarity on your mission, on your path, what you need to do, what actions you need to take, and it's leading to victory. What do we need to know? Creative endeavors are going to pay off. You putting your time and attention into your creativity, working on yourself. This is going to go the distance. This is going to be long-lasting. This actually fell out under going the distance. What you create will be long lasting and it will be uh, bring in financial abundance. What else do we need to know? What else do we need to know? You know, what I'm getting is you are really standing in your power now. You're stepping into masculine energy. The King of Wands talks about being very passionate and driven. You're really um, taking control over your life and what it is that you want to succeed. 
Um, so this is your creative endeavors. This is making um, life altering changes, how you view things, releasing people that aren't in alignment. But this is you really being passionate. You're going within for answers. I do see a new opportunity coming in. I see multiple doors opening up and it's because you're connected with your higher self, the lovers. You're connected with your higher self. So you're operating in the 5D and not the 3D. Complete emotional fulfillment. Happy home, happy life coming in for you. Whoops, look at this. High Priestess to the Nine of Cups. Heightened intuition, relying on your intuition, manifesting the life that you want is bringing in multiple wishes in your life. That's awesome, okay. What else do we need to know? be happy. I'm just going to tell you what I felt. There were people that were connected to your energy in the past that they tried so hard to destroy you, but none of their plans worked. It's in reverse, right? You know, these are people that may have juggled you, may have chosen other things over you, but here you are speaking your truth, cutting people out that don't serve you, and you're still getting a blessing of new beginnings. So basically what I'm getting is don't worry about the intentions of other people. Protect your space, protect your energy, and go after what you're passionate about. What makes you happy, okay? Because victory is going to be yours. In the end, victory is yours. So it really makes no difference. Don't let others affect your energy. Oops. Yeah. Oh. The lies, the deception, the heartbreak. St. Michael is here saying, don't worry. Now is the time for balance to be restored. You went through a lot, but now you're moving on into milk and honey. Happiness, joy, success, stability, twin flame soulmate, a new union. For some of you, it's a new union that's coming in quick. For others, this is just um, building a stable foundation, finding that stability within yourself. You know, there is a sudden change that's coming. You know, this change is going to come in and you're not going to expect it. This could be career finance. This could be love. I don't get this as a bad tower. I get this as a surprise from the universe. You're going to make a decision. When this change, when this sudden action or sudden event occurs, it is your good karma. This action or event that's going to occur is actually going to put you in a more stable energy. Queen of Pentacles, very grounded, stable, financially secure. So... There is a surprise that the universe is bringing in for you. Yeah, you're loving yourself. You're releasing anything, people, place, or thing that caused you to feel trapped or uncertain. And you're moving on to peace. Oops. <laughs> for many of you... Someone from the past may try to come in and finally give an offer, but you're uninterested. You're absolutely not interested. They don't even want you to worry about it. But they're just bringing it up. Cycles close. You have nothing to worry about. Yeah, wheels turning in your favor. You are the star. This came out yesterday. You're meant to shine. You're meant to be in the limelight. You're meant to heal others. You're meant to help others. This is fame, fortune. This is destiny. And no one, no matter what they plot or plan or how bad they slander you, can affect your destiny. They can't. They just reap karma from it. So God wants you to stay focused on what it is you're being called to do. Look, yeah, toxic people. They can't interfere doing black magic. They can't interfere. There's no power greater than God. So you don't have to worry. You've healed. Um, you've done the healing work. And, you know, you're calling in um, new opportunities get, that's going to be balanced, equal give and take. You may be getting a message about a new creative endeavor, a career in finance. Yeah. God knows all that you've been through. He does. God knows the pain. God knows the battle, right? 
And you have this emperor energy. I believe this is someone from the past wanting to return to reconnect, but you're moving on. You're moving on to Ten of Pentacles, generational wealth. You're in this proud, confident, independent energy. You have no desire to have someone from the past come in and try and control you again. You already know what they're about. And justice is being served. Part of your justice is a soulmate, a true divine partner that's going to love you equally. That's part of your justice. So just know that it's meant for you. You deserve it. And I'm going to get from another deck and see what comes out, guys. Let's, let's do the little deck. A.E. Wait. All right. What do we need to know, please? Holy Spirit, holy angels and saints. What do we need to know for our greater good? What do we need to know for our greater good? Man, this is crazy, guys. The past energy, because we're in Pisces season, emotions are running high. Karma is being served. People are being forced to reflect on their past choices. This is why these people keep coming in. But this player energy, Knight of Wands in reverse, is stuck. They're stuck in their life. And they're being exposed. They have been given the clarity by the divine about their actions and the consequences of their actions. But the community is also seeing this person for who they are. Now they want to apologize. Man. Yeah. Wanting to come in and give a love offer to you, but they're being hit with a tower. Because of the ten swords they put in your back. And now they're receiving that same ten swords. So they think if they can communicate and say they're sorry that it's going to lighten that burden. But nope. It's not going to happen. It doesn't work that way. Yeah. The days of breadcrumbing is over for whoever this is. God's putting an end to their games, their mind games, and how they hurt other people. Especially this empress in reverse. Which is you. What else do we need to know? Yeah, you're manifesting new beginnings in career and finance. And it's going to be successful. You're a powerful manifester. Multiple doors are opening up for you. You're no longer in the energy of heartbreak or pain or regret or sadness. You're just planting those seeds, manifesting the life that you want. Healing. Healing every day. And that's what's opening these doors to new beginnings. Ace of Wands, a gift from God. Your own actions, your energy, your healing, um, the intentions you put out is what's calling in these new opportunities. Look at that. You're making plans for the future. You know that your ships are coming in. You know things are aligning for you, and that's justice. Look at that. Twin flame soulmate coming in for you. It's because you went through a long, hard battle, and you didn't give up. You went through many um, sleepless nights. A lot of tears cried, a lot of anxiety, but now... Here's the sun. You're in your power. You're happy. So you, so the hard part's over, guys. And that's what I'm getting. All right. I love you. I hope you guys have an amazing day. Bye-bye.